bitch. Like it or leave it. I'm just like that. I got a her jacket and shit. You see how I said? I couldn't button this motherfucker up no further than this. This is what you get. And it is two dudes in here that would fuck me, and that's all I need. That's all I need is two. Okay, let me get the fuck down. This is cool. I'm about to tap some motherfuckers. When I tap you, I need you to stand your big ass up on the stage. We ain't doing no jokes tonight. We playing Biggest Loser. There's it's a hundred people here eating crabs, and I'm the only big motherfucker in here tonight. So if I'm the only one that built my own crab sauce. No, for real. Am I the only one that built my own crab sauce? Cherry Hill. 
This was a hood sports bar. They served two kinds of wings, regular and menthol. This was a hood. Take off the black and mild, thank you. But you know most sports bars in the suburbs, they got like six flat screen TVs over the bar. You can see the game from every angle. This joint had one TV and six mirrors. I was like, that's some bullshit. Why is Tony Flacco throwing left hand? I can't figure shit out. Joe Flacco. Yeah, fuck me getting that wrong. I'm going to get my ass beat just for that. But I do like coming at it. It was cool. I like figuring out where I am in the city by the bumper stickers I read. So coming to this joint, I saw a bumper sticker that read, Snitches get stitches. <laughs> it was on an ambulance. <laughs> Driving past the White House, I was near a presidential limousine. Papa Sticker said, I got 99 problems, but a Nick ain't one. <laughs> Speaking of which, y'all ready for the election? I'm ready too. I got my official Barack Obama Hope portrait. Yeah. <laughs> Looks a little distorted, right? This is actually painted by a student with autism in DC high schools. And when the president ever finds out about this, the budget for autism research is going to be cut by 50%. I swear to God. That's some ugly ass shit, isn't it? Looks like you're back from the Goonies. I don't know. Let's get it. Y'all glad I've been on Def Comedy Jam, BET, man. I'm in a fucking barn in West Baltimore. This is a bitch. The fuck am I doing here? This motherfucker, this is ridiculous. I ain't never seen no shit like this. This bitch said Vine Street. This bitch on Gorman, bitch. You need to get your direction straight. I went past everything around this bitch. Ah, damn, this is terrible. I gotta get the fuck out of here. Matter of fact, I know y'all hate the police. I hate y'all. See, so matter of fact, all y'all drink up tonight. Drink up. Drink. Keep drinking up. Cause after the show, I'm going to the man gonna put my uniform on and put all you niggas over. <laughs> you funny as shit? Shut up, get the fuck out of this. I'm a poke ass police, I've been a police for a long time. I'm a Baltimore City police, I know y'all hate the police, I don't give a fuck. I, I, I ain't there to help none of y'all bitches. I'm there for the benefits of the credit union, bitch. That is it. I don't give a fuck about none of y'all. I fuck all of y'all. I don't need have fellow police. This nigga talking about officer down, like that means something to me. He down, I'm up. White cops and black cops, and then I love white police. White police are all the shit. Because white police don't play. White police, they think they're going to save the world. They think they're going to save the city. Well, they let that y'all. They do shit like show up to the call for the call, even come the fuck out. Level 23? Level 23. I got a black man on 10 4 I'm already here. You can't get a black cop as far like that. You know, those niggas lazy. Level 23. Level 23. Level 23. Level 23. Level 23. <laughs> Yeah, I call a nigga cell phone, I know who this, the dispatcher, and your fuck radio. This <laughs> police all the, if you white, I pull you over all day, I pull white people over all day. If you black, I do not pull black people over. Let me tell you why, it ain't because I'm racist, let me tell you why. White people got something that black people don't got, their registration. I don't know what y'all niggas do with y'all registration. <laughs> you ask a black person for a registration, they look at you like you asked for a credit report. I don't know what that bitch had. <laughs> ask one girl for a registration, why did bitch pop the trunk? Why you pop the trunk for your registration? This one nigga, I said, nice to registration. He said, I want a lawyer. For your registration? Why you want a lawyer for your registration? I hate being a cop. Cause y'all always get mad at them. Why crime so bad in Baltimore? I'm gonna tell you why crime so bad in Baltimore. Cause first of all, Baltimore rough as shit. We going through a recession, we broke as hell. You don't believe me? Look at our police car. We got the most raggedy ass police cars you ever seen in your life. You know your police car fucked up when you pull somebody for a violation on their car, and your car got the same fucking violation. <laughs> I pull somebody away yesterday, the excuse me, so your hand like that. He's not my yours, too, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> and your windshield crack. It's a goddamn mind that you are. I had to get myself two tickets. <laughs> you know, boy, I'm a broke. How you run out of crime scene, Tim? That's why I didn't get shot and killed over there. We had my happy birthday streamers around here. His name ain't dead. We had happy birthday streamers around his body. You did when happy birthday stream was around your body. <laughs> I hate being a cop boy, man. I'm saying I don't fuck myself playing too fucking much. I hate this shit. And I'm a punk, I can't fight. I said right now, I do not fight. 
I'm gonna tell you why I was like, anybody, anybody ever get beat up before? You ever get beat up before? Anybody ever get beat up? You ever get beat up and go home and practice the moves you should have done? <laughs> Soon as he grabbed my neck, I should have grabbed that pinky. I should have grabbed this fucking pinky. Soon as he grabbed my neck, I knew that shit. I knew I was gonna pass out. Cause I can't fight no shit. Y'all fucking y'all laughing because when you can't fight, women think you gonna have to fight. Every time I'm doing something happening, my wife is supposed to get involved because I'm a police officer. Why I'm in the bank the other day, somebody gonna come up with a ski mask and a gun come on. Get on the ground and don't nobody say shit. I'm the first nigga in the ground. I'm like, fuck this, I ain't gonna fight, I ain't gonna get blank. My wife told me, you better get up and do something. You're a police officer, so I did. I stood right up and said, excuse me, sir, that bitch talking and we're right far away. <laughs> you talk too much. I'm a punk, that's why y'all never see you'll never see my wife come to a show at a club. Don't ever take your wife to a club where you know you can't fight. You ever go to a club where your woman get involved in an argument with a guy bigger than you and gonna stir at you like she supposed to help? My wife's staring at me, I'm staring right back at her. We're in a stern contest. <laughs> she said that guy trying to get my phone number, I said, give it to him, it's you. <laughs> she goes, about, won't you be a man for a change? I said, I ain't been a man all this time. Well, I'm gonna start today, bitch. So I go over to the guy, I said, what's your name? He said, my name is Mike. And I said, I don't want to fight, I want to talk. My wife like nice things. You got a job, how much you make a year? He said, 500000 I said, whatever, Mike. I said, my wife like nice cars. You got a nice car, what kind of car you get? This motherfucker said a Mercedes Benz. I said, whatever, Mike. The man answered another question, Mike. He said, what? I said, you got a boyfriend? He said, no. I said, nigga, you want one? Because you have everything I'm looking for. Fuck this bitch, I don't know why. I'm wasting my time with this raggedy bitch. She broke. Just fucking around. I ain't gay and I ain't gonna get gay people. If you gay in 2012, be gay, that's your problem. And the problem with gay people, they got gay people everywhere. Then they gave me a gay police partner one time. I was mad because he was gay, I was mad because he didn't tell me. This is how I found out he was gay. He gonna look by, by the way, he gonna describe a suspect on the radio to my I'm looking for a black male, wavy hair, mocha skin, hazel eyes, and a chisel chef. Nigga, who the fuck you looking for? I should bitch, I ain't never been nobody like that. We ain't learn that shit in the cabin. That's some fag shit. You a fag. And he me talk about doing gay shit. I had to be gay last year for 22 minutes. I just turned 40 last year. My wife got me tickets to go skydiving. I ain't never been skydiving a day in my life. Man, don't ever go skydiving. Because let me tell you right now, you don't go by yourself. What they do is strap another man to your ass while you slow down the earth. But the whole time, he kissing the back of my neck and blowing my fucking ear. So I said, you better stop. He said, sit up, bitch, while I'm driving. You know what I'm saying? This nigga talking about, who's your daddy? You my fucking daddy! I got two more lessons. No wrong with gay people. I got a gay cousin of mine. Ain't no wrong with, look, I, go, I got gay cousin. I hang on with my gay cousin. Let me tell you something. Ain't no wrong with gay people. He got me go to a gay club one time just to see what it's like. I'll go to a gay club, nigga. If you ever feel like you got low self-esteem, go to a gay club. Them motherfuckers was all over me. I, I felt like I was the shit. They was buying me drinks, piling me around the whole night. I said, this is the shit. So I'm sitting there chilling in the corner, and gay people got some bad ass music. I ain't gonna hear their own music. I'm sitting there dancing. This is how I go ahead and stop dancing when they had their own lyrics. I'm like, give me that, give me that, give me that, dick. I said, I'm done. I ain't dancing no fucking more. Where the fuck this song come from? Who sing this shit? Give me that, give me that, give me that dick. I said, I ain't singing, I'm dancing no more. <laughs> Who the fuck with that? Lick the balls. I said, I'm done. I'm not gonna dance off of lick the balls. I'm done. <laughs> you got gay club music. <laughs> give me that, give me that, give me that dick. <laughs> I'm glad to be here. A lot of y'all beautiful women here. I love y'all women. I do right now. I'm talking about like that. Men's gotta stop cheating on your women in 2012. Stop cheating on your fucking women in 2012. Because first of all, don't clap for that shit. I'm gonna tell you why, because men don't know how to cheat. No, we don't know how to cheat. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Don't do that there. Never cheat on a woman with a cell phone. Your ass don't know how to work. You ever do that shit? I'm on the phone. My girlfriend, my wife called. I press the button. We all on the freeway. I'm like, this is bullshit. <laughs> Every time she say my name, I get tapped. Timmy, ah. Timmy, ah. I'm gonna do this shit all night, bitch. Ah. If you marry, don't look at me. I don't fucking marry women no more. Married women cheat the most. I'm fucking with a married woman. She will come to the club with another guy and he's her fucking husband. I called her husband right out and right up. I said, yo, who wife that ain't cheating on you? He said, who this? Nigga, this is her boyfriend. Now get down here and we lose her. 
don't know where he came from, but we ain't gonna make it with him in our life. <laughs> y'all damn, but let me tell y'all something. You cheat on your woman, your woman will cheat on you. I found out my wife was going out with another guy one time. I said, I ain't gonna say that. I'm gonna follow them around, find out where they go. I follow them motherfuckers around. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Come to find out, this, this guy treat my wife better than I ever treated. He was good in my eye. I know why she cheated on me. This motherfucker took her all the places I could for. I said, he is good to her. She deserved that motherfucker. I went home and put my pajamas on. She gonna walk in the house. I wasn't even mad. I was like one of her girlfriends. So, how was he? Girl, you look so happy! And I gotta stop being one on Facebook. Stop. Leave that Facebook shit alone. I'm fucking with a girl on Facebook one time. I ain't gonna lie. This bitch y'all tricky. This girl finds out on what? On Facebook, on every picture, she gonna lean back like this on every picture. I'm like, why she gonna lean back on every picture? Now, this girl is gorgeous. I go pick this girl up. Why this bitch is paralyzed from the waist down? <laughs> she done had her girlfriend duck down in the picture and hold up like this. <laughs> Y'all laughing. I still fucked up, but you ain't gotta do that shit to people. I'm gonna still hit it, but you ain't gotta do that shit to people. You gonna lean back like this and you paralyzed. I'm just fucking around, I ain't gonna be here long, they ain't paying me that much money. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm glad to be, like I said, a lot of things change when you get married. A lot of things change, first of all, I got married, and that's just fucked me up. The biggest one was sex for me, I don't understand a man's body. I don't know if anybody's married, got a girl with a boyfriend, shit changed. My wife got mad at me the other day, come on, she wasn't all over my wife the other day, come on, get off of me. I said, what's wrong, you better touch me, lick me, caress me, and get me wet. So I spit on my ass, Did you went down, I worked them off. <laughs> I ain't got time for that shit. You better call your boyfriend. Y'all can name all y'all want, but you can do something for y'all, you can do something for me. I don't mind going on a woman. I'm 40 years old. I don't mind going on a woman. That's my shit, not all. Because some of y'all women, y'all got the shade. Some of y'all sitting there right now with y'all shit braided. You know the fuck you are. I went down to one girl one time. I'm cutting down trees. I'm raking leaves. She done gave me poison ivy. This how you get poison ivy. Some little man popped out in the jungle. This the fuck is that shit? You got the Lion King in your vagina. I don't like doing that joke. See, because all the women that get mad at me. I don't get my girl got pissed off at me. So first of all, Mr. Comedian, it's my body. We don't shave down there for no man. You're right, don't shave your vagina for no man, woman. That's your shit that God gave you. Don't shave your vagina for no man. Do that shit for your clitoris because y'all killing it. Most of y'all got a dead clitoris, you don't even know it. I went down to one girl one time, I pulled the head back. Her clitoris gonna pop out tomorrow. <laughs> She's gonna kill me! I had to get up his mouth to mouth. Don't you die on me. You know you're gonna fucking hurt, bro. <laughs> Look at y'all women laughing. Watch y'all go home and like, uh. I did not know. <laughs> y'all laughing. Tell them, man, we like old sex too, don't we, bro? All men like that shit. Not all. Let me tell you, bro. It ain't how y'all give a blowjob making fun when you do that, making excitement. I had a girl give me a blowjob when I'm on the highway one time. If you ever get a blowjob while you drive on the highway, man, do me a throw, bro. Don't stay on the road, they don't fuck. Go on the shoulder of the road, it's real rough. It's like in the massage for your dick, just, ha! Ah. And make sure you hit all the bumps, ha! Ah. Hit every bump, ha! Ah. I did that shit for eight miles, just, ha! Ah. I'm gonna kill this bitch, ha! Ah. Ha! Ah. <laughs> Look at y'all there, but look. They ain't right around the corner, I bet you jumped on 83 tonight. This ain't the way home. Oh. <laughs> and I realized I ain't that good at sex no more. I done got old. I ain't got time for that shit. That's why I know I'm, I'm smart. I don't make love to no woman. If you healthy, don't look at me. I don't make love to no woman healthy. I'm not fuck that. But the healthy woman lets you know the truth. I'm making love to a girl one time. She's healthy. I'm making love to her the whole time. She ain't making no noise the whole time. She like that. She just stirring that. She ain't making no noise. She ain't making no fucking noise. You gotta hear that noise to get off. I said, fuck, man. I'm making this other song. I'm making love to sick women. If you sick, I'll fuck the shit out of you. I'm making love to one girl one time. She got an oxygen tank. It's the best sex I've ever had. We making love. She ain't making no noise. I pulled that to you right out her nose. You coming, bitch? You going down, bitch? Who the greatest? You going down, bitch? I'm Timmy. Who's the? Say my name. Timmy. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Don't hear that noise all the way home. I don't know. But I'm not 
learned a couple things about living up being with a woman. First of all, you gotta learn how to live with your woman. You live with your woman, first of all, you gotta listen up, man. First of all, if you got one rule, you got shit to worry about. Everything in the fucking house is hers. You remember that shit? You got nothing to worry about. Me and my got two dresses in our bedroom. Her dresser and my dresser. Her shit out there. Sleep the fuck on my dresser. The other day I take a shower, put lotion on the old room, put powder on my chest, all the way up to my neck, because I'm from Baltimore. That's what we do all the way from here. <laughs> <laughs> I go to the gym and play basketball and everything's sweating on me, but for some reason my chest is dry as shit and I can't figure out why. I go on the power, I got on. I got some fucking summer's Eve magic on power on my fucking chest. I walk around smelling like the fresh vagina on my fucking chest. Don't laugh, this is the best power I've ever used. This is the shits. I've been sweating eight days. This is the best power in the world. You better get some summer's Eve magic on power. This is the shits. I don't know. Let me start talking about sex. I'm watching, my wife got me watching, I'm watching porno film now. You know, women don't want to give you no sex like they used to. I'm watching porno film. No, let me tell you something, man. If you watch porno film, don't ever watch porno film with a woman that don't like to watch it because she gonna fuck up your whole experience. I'm watching porno film. I'm like, let me see this bullshit. I press play. This girl giving the best blowjob I ever seen. I said, look at that shit right there. That's the thing. This birthday was anniversary, bitch. She's sucking her dick. It's a Tuesday. She's sucking her dick because it's Tuesday. I watch it, I'm like, yeah, that bitch can suck a dick, but she didn't turn. I said, you know what, bitch, don't watch it with me no more. You worry about this bitch's hand. You don't even know her. You don't know Pinky. You don't know Pinky. Pinky had a hard day at work. <laughs> Pinky had a hard day at work. You worry about Pinky's hand. Pick you up the car, 
Police officer, nigga, run that motherfucker window, y'all. Five up, nigga, run that motherfucker window, y'all. <laughs> he did that for twenty minutes and realized he's not running the whole window. He ain't left his motherfucker car yet. He's still in the whole window. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 